Hello everyone, hello lovely people. This is Kobe. Um on YouTube I'm Jack G H J A K K G H all in caps and on 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 Instagram I'm Abel Abel underscore copy and on Facebook normal Facebook Abel copy but when it comes to my Facebook official it is also Jack G H so follow me on all these platforms and we'll have a chat today I'm not going to do any um, comedy sk uh, skit even though um, um, I've missed out for like two weeks but I decided to do it differently because of some of the questions that came across and some of the questions that are coming from other friends and, and people who know me very well so I decided to talk about it and then we all share our thoughts and ideas on, on it and then probably we'll also learn a lesson out of it now where from these questions all this lockdown things is making like it's making people crazy about certain things depending on where you are coming from for example being in the room without doing anything without moving anywhere it's like you are not in your comfort zone for who knows how long but there are certain things out of this lockdown has taught me and I believe um, um, it also I mean gave you certain lessons that uh, 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 you, it will move with you in your life which is a positive thing somewhere along the line so let's see so today I'm going to answer about four questions there were many questions but I I grouped them into four categories where I mean because I realized that almost every question geared to one direction so why not group them in different different um, I mean areas so if it is about 20 questions I was able to cut it down but it's the same so anybody who who sent me um, my question just forgive me maybe I, I I wouldn't read it the way you wrote it but you could really see that it's actually a question you also ask and they all boil into one direction so today we are going to talk about that one first of all this my shirt here is from Ghana Ghana from Tina collection Tina collection if you want some just drop your your request on the on the comment section and you have it you see I brought it from Ghana so looking at my background I'm not in Ghana uh, I wouldn't want to display um, uh, um, mention any the name yet but the time will come I'll give you the name so um, we'll go straight to the point but I can see I look I look fresh even though my face looks uh, bushy my head looks bushy my face hairy 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 everywhere but it's all good man it's all good. so this is the first question that came in. how do you cope with the lockdown the lockdown being in different country without your family that's a great question you know that's a wonderful question how do I cope with the lockdown even without my family I miss my family I miss home I really miss home very very dearly but aside that I think because I already knew my family isn't with me I tune my mind and what I do is that almost every blessed day I do video call with them it's not easy when you are alone I mean it's different from video call even though we can do video call but you know it's 
the, the feeling with the family, I mean physical, is different from video calls. But at least that will bridge a bit of bridge. Better than nothing at all. Forget about the noise in the background. The guys are enjoying themselves with the jet. So for me, how, 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 how what helped me in coping is always making sure that I talk to the family, I laugh with my baby girl, which I miss so much. I miss my home, you know, even though can see from the background it's a nice place but Africa is Africa Africa is Africa home is home you can't take it from anybody so I miss home it's not easy for me but I've tuned my mind in such a way that no one caused it I can't help it the only thing I have to do is to take care of myself and make sure that I stay safe so that maybe when I get a chance, then I'll be able to have that life to see my family again. So I'm trying to, I mean, uh, I'm doing this, uh, and then I mean, staying in the house, I can watch movie and watch movie and get tired. So that is what. It's not, I mean, good about the whole situation. But again, my job, I mean, my company keeps me engaged. Always, I mean, every day meetings, uh, some exercises, um, interaction. I mean, virtual inter interactions, which helps a bit. You see that you, you meet people, you see videos. And all that, and I, I also speak to people back home, friends back home. So they all come, they all, they, it's all a package, you know. I, I can't, I can't bring in the physical aspect of it until I get there. But the little I, I use, or uh, I'm able to use to cope, is what I've just told you. Number two is, how do you eat? How do you eat? <laughs> in actual fact. Everybody eats. Everyone eats. Um, if whether you know how to cook or you don't know how to cook, our modern days is such that no matter who you are, you get something to eat. But me personally, I am somebody. I think we have people like that. People like me, more like me, that. Eating outside, I mean, it's a bit, a bit difficult for me. But this is where I will, I will, I will thank my auntie. I'll thank my moms. Let's now thank my moms. I'll thank my auntie. I'll thank my moms. Aunt Lizzie, Mommy Maggie, Mama Grace. I'll thank them so much because. In as much as I'm a, I'm a male, they put that aspect in quote the male aside, and then decided to groom me in all the angles. So when it comes to cooking, I'm a chef. Sorry, I'm a chef. I'm a chef. I can cook, and I even. I even want to try things differently that that has not I mean things that doesn't exist because cooking is art unless you don't understand but cooking is art so I even try so many things and I do so many things and people love it so I cook myself that is that is something that nobody can take it from me and this is a simple advice I'll give to people mostly the guys please don't sit in the room thinking that the ladies will cook for you don't relax behind the television or behind game thinking that ladies will cook for you i see my own to be like a preparation towards this season or particular season not only this one because anywhere i travel to 
I don't buy outside. The only thing you see me buying outside, unless maybe today, let me go and try something. But it's not almost not every day that I'll be doing it. I cook my own food, buy, I do my own shopping, I come home, I prepare my own food. People love it. Those whoever taste, has tasted my food loves it. So that is what I will tell you. Just, just, just be yourself. Just understand that it's cool to, I mean, to learn, learn from your parents. Let your mother groom you. Allow yourself to be groomed. Don't just be, sit, cook for me to eat, but put yourself into it, and then take part in the cooking. And I bet you, it will help you some days. Because it's not always that you get a place to, to sit, and not always that you get what you want, but the moment to learn how to do it yourself, you can do anything that you want with it. You can cook anything you want. Today, if I like, if I want to cook, I decide on what to cook. This week, I decide on what to eat, what to prepare, because I was well trained. So, to my colleague guys out there, please, learning how to cook, eh, add something special to your life, and you will never and ever and ever I mean suffer anywhere because you can eat whatever you want so that's a little advice for my friends out there I hope you 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 get this this portion and then you start learning those who don't know how to do it those who have started please go ahead and those who know how to do it please please continue and don't 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 say the ladies are there so you are not going to do it just do it it will help you when you get married you you won't uh, uh, wait for your mom to come and cook for your wife when she she needs your help at that point or when she's in a position where she can't cook again and you need to help within some period of time you can do that you can do that for your wife i mean and your children as well i thank you for uh, uh, i'm taking this advice i know you will take it